Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Taisha. Thank you for clicking on today's video. I did my hair. There's nothing like straightening your hair like the first day. It just feels super soft. I'm using some new products from L'Oreal that I've really been liking. They come in like a purple container. I think they're called the Glacing Collection or the Glossy Hair Collection. I don't know, but it's really good. So yeah, that's what I use for my hair and I just love fresh straight hair. It lasts like a day though. Probably, no, I'm lying. It lasts like six hours, six good hours. And then after that, it kind of turns like a little wavy-ish, you know? But I just did my makeup, you guys. I did like a soft glam makeup look. And I also used the Givenchy powder in the shade three with the e.l.f. powder puff. One of you guys actually told me they released one. So I went to their website and I ordered one. Girl, this is amazing. I feel like this works better than the Amazon ones because they're a lot more like you know puffy so yeah i really like this one um the amazon ones you do get more but i feel like you get a more flawless finish with the elf one and i think you can clean it as well low care reminds me of the beauty blender one but a lot more inexpensive and then for my lip combo it's the one that i have on my instagram page so yeah those are my makeup details of today i also got my degree you guys my degree is finally here i cannot believe i have a degree i have two actually i have an associates and i also have a bachelor's degree in marketing so yeah i don't know i feel like it feels weird because it's already like back to school season you know and this is the first time pretty much ever in my life that i'm not going to school in the fall time and i do not know how to feel i'm thinking of putting my degree right over here in my shelves so you guys see i have my shelves here and i'm thinking of putting it right here so this is the one they give you at first let me turn the camera around okay so this is the one they give you at first um and then here's my other one and then here's like the one they give you at the graduation ceremony this is the one they give you at the ceremony and then here is the real one all the hard work dedication you know consistency headaches everything 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 <laughs> the money everything is for this right here so yeah i got this frame from etsy and you know it gets me really emotional to see it so i like to hide it because i honestly cannot believe it but yeah guys like i was telling you i cannot believe i have a degree i have two degrees i when i first started school like i remember graduating from high school it's not what i wanted to do it's such like confusing times it's such a hard time growing up honestly but especially like you know being so young and telling you like go figure out what you want to do it's like super stressful but i'm really happy i went with marketing like it's such a fun degree to me you know it can be hard but girl everything in life is hard but if you put your mind to it and you become like consistent you know you sacrifice your time for something you will achieve it so for all my girls going back to school you know starting college or going back no matter what age it doesn't matter um you know i just that's my I guess advice for you is just to focus on what you started low-key it makes me super emotional to even look at it so i don't even like to look at it because i get emotional you know we left everything behind we came with suitcases i think we had like four maybe five suitcases and we left our whole life over there in puerto rico to come here to texas and work you know get to work and accomplish dreams so yeah guys that is all i'm gonna say before i start crying and ruin my makeup because i will ruin it in two seconds i'm just gonna hide that degree because then i'm gonna start crying i'm gonna stop talking and get to filming i also need to clean up a little bit i always need to have my room clean if not it just like messes with my head i'm a like stressful cleaner i told you guys that before so i'm gonna clean a little bit and go to the grocery store later so i'll probably take you guys along with me so you guys can see what i like to get i don't need a lot of stuff just things to make a smoothie because i've been really loving this smoothie that i've been making all you need is strawberries um bananas and almond milk and dates like three dates and you're good and it tastes sweet and it fills you up and it's just amazing i have a sweet tooth so yeah that's like a little bit more healthy you know so yeah let me start filming and i'll see you guys in a second 
Okay guys, so I made it to Sprouts. I always like to go to the sushi section first. This is actually my favorite sushi from um, Sprouts. It's this one right here, it's so good. Okay, so if you guys haven't tried this milk, I highly recommend it. Oh no, I was gonna buy two, but I guess we'll only get one. This is my favorite milk, it's so good. Um, I don't think it tastes like real milk, but it's just way better for you. So I get this one, the unsweetened one. I haven't tried the vanilla one before. So I guess I'll try this one as well. But yeah, this is what I'm getting so far. And if you have a sweet tooth like me, and you have to have something sweet, but you want to be a little bit more healthy, I do recommend you guys pick this ones up. I like the vanilla and also this one. Or the vanilla and also the strawberry are really good. And they are $4.49. I'm gonna get one of these. Okay, so this is basically all I got for today's grocery run. I did get a lot of sushi because it's for my sister, my mom. And then this one's mine. And yeah, you can never go wrong with protein chips. So I'm just waiting to pay. Okay guys, so I'm about to get ready. I put on some lashes and did my brows, of course. Let's just pretend, you know, my brows are naturally like this. But um, you've seen the Amazon lashes that I showed you guys on my Amazon favorites. They're this brand right here. I love them, you guys, only for this look. Like, when I wear them like that, I feel like it makes my eye look lacy. But when I cut them up and kind of put them on the corner, it makes them look more like, you know, angled. Um, I also got this new clip right here from walmart it was five dollars they have like a whole like latina section which is so cool to see um so yeah i got this little clip from there i have some new makeup i wanted to test out with you guys that i got from ulta so i have this chanel ultra like I, I don't i'm not even gonna try to pronounce this i can barely speak english so yeah this is what it looks like right here got this in the shade bd31 i'm getting ready since i'm gonna go i might go to the mall um today is sunday by the way so these are my favorite there's just something about sunday that just feels like self-care days so i want to go to ulta or not ulta, i want to go to sephora to pick up a um a, like a hyper pigmentation cream that i saw a lot of people like and i also might want to pick up more of my brow pencil this is my favorite brow pencil from refi is it refi or refi no i feel like it's refi but yeah i love that brand everything they come up with i love it so yeah i might just go and pick that up if not i'll just order it online but for sure i'm going to td max so let me prime my face i'm gonna be using this primer right here from them as well i'm going for like a natural makeup let's see if it looks natural because sometimes i be saying that and then i do a whole soft glam look but you know when you have oily skin you kind of have to or it's gonna look like it because of the powder but i feel like powder is what makes your makeup look very flawless you know so it just gives you like a really nice like you just drink your water life is good healthy glowing skin you know so really like this primer i do recommend it guys i need a new vanity because the one that i built okay so i have my vanity right and i built it a long time ago i think i built it when i was in high school and it was like $30. I got them from Michaels online. And I got them, yeah, I think I was like a senior. Whenever I worked at McDonald's. So, yeah, I got them. They were $30. I built them myself. I even made them like a little higher for me because I am 5'7". So you know they were like super short so i made them like custom made for me but they're completely falling apart like i cannot even open the bottom one without like having like the whole lid coming off um they're just expensive and i want the impressions vanity one but that one's like 800 dollars. so i don't know if i want to spend that much money on a vanity hopefully they have like a sale well they do have a sale going on but i want like a 50 percent off sale you know so yeah i'm thinking of buying a new vanity let me know if anybody has that one if you recommend it i don't like that it's see-through at the like the top that's the only thing i don't like because then you can see my stuff and i don't like seeing it i feel like it makes it look very crowded so yeah i'm just putting on my foundation from chanel this is the first time i'm using this on my face and it looks very light but I already swatched it. I swatched it in my hand and it looks light, but I think it oxidizes. And it smells like, like expensive makeup. That's what it smells like. I got this from Ulta with my like, um, what is it called, my reward. So I got it for really inexpensive. This might be my winter shade, but for summer, I'm gonna have to mix it in. 
or even for fall. This is like the perfect shade for me from Dior in the shade 4WO. I always be doing that. I love listening to music when I do my makeup. Have you guys heard the new Garo G song? You guys, she is my queen. I love her. She's my favorite artist. And she looks even prettier in person because I went to her last concert last year and she's just beautiful. I'm going to be using this one from One Size Beauty in the shade 4NG. Um, let me do some powder now. I finally got the pink setting powder. I also got the old, not the Ulta one. Girl, I can't even talk. Um, I also got the Huda Beauty one, the cherry one. I got that one and I haven't tried it out either. But yeah, I'm going to be using the Morphe one in brightening pink. I haven't filmed in a while. And when I don't film in a while, I kind of like forget how to speak English. Because in my house, I only speak Spanish. Especially now since I graduated already. I have like no reason to be speaking English except for with all of you. So yeah, if you guys notice my English starts getting bad, it's because of that. I be forgetting, girl. It does look pink, kind of peachy. It looks like a peachy pink. So yeah, let me just remove some and apply it. It just looks kind of like white. But yeah, I just might as well order it already because I really need a new vanity. It's like those things I don't want to buy, but like I need, you know, that's how I feel about my vanity. And I'm kind of like attached to this one as well because I built it myself, you know, and I bought it myself. I think it was like one of the first things I bought for myself that were like big purchases because for me, that was like a really big purchase, you know, even though it was like, I think it was in total like $100 or $150. That to me is a lot of money. So... You know, I'm kind of like attached to it because I bought it myself with my first job. You guys, I haven't had jaw pain or like right here any pain in a while because I did get Botox. I forgot to tell you guys that, but yeah, I just got Botox right here and then right here on my forehead. Like literally like right here because of my headaches. Like my headaches are super bad. I forget what it's called. It's called masseter Botox. So that's what I did because he noticed like all the pain and i keep grinding my teeth at night so i will wake up with like a lot of pain here and then my ears ringing and then a really bad headache so ever since i did that i feel like it's really been helping i actually didn't know dentists knew how to do botox i always thought it was like for wrinkles but turns out you can use it for jaw like right here like the pain here so if you have that i recommend you talk to your dentist and maybe you know he'll guide you through that but i always thought wrinkles was like or right here and like right here i don't know so i'm just drawing back my beauty marks this is something i highly recommend you guys do so your makeup looks more like natural you know and nobody knows you are nine layers in nobody's gonna know okay so let me do my lip combo off camera i'm gonna change the battery and then i'll show you guys the final look okay guys so this is the final makeup look for today kind of like natural-ish you know i feel like the lashes look really good um hopefully they look good on camera but in person they look like natural you know and pretty but yeah this is the final look right here my natural no makeup makeup look so yeah this is the look right here i might put my hair up actually i still do not know because i think it's hot outside it's been like weird weather here it's like rainy and then it's like sunny and then i don't know it's bipolar also you guys look what i did i went ahead and put them up they used to be like down but i just put them up let me know if you guys like them um i need to get new flowers just ignore that but yeah this is what it looks like now let me know if you guys like it like this or down because this wall it's so big i was thinking of getting like some lights right here you know the lights that go above the frames from amazon yeah i was thinking of getting that let me know if you guys like them also since we're talking about amazon let me share with you guys some other stuff that i got from amazon um like new amazon finds so i got some new lights right here just ignore that i need to clean everything so yeah i got some new lights and look you just turn them on like that and they're magnetic also and you can charge them like yourself so you don't have to get a battery you know batteries make them like very heavy and also batteries can get expensive so yeah this one you can charge it yourself and then they're magnetic so you can just put it like that and you're good i think this one you can also change the color yeah you see 
Isn't this so cool? I think it was under $15, so it was affordable. I'll go ahead and have them linked below for you guys, but I just feel like it adds like a more expensive look to my shelves, you know, and then I can just turn it off right here. But yeah, guys, it's really only 11.30, so I woke up pretty early today, which I am proud of myself because I am not a morning person. I'd rather wake up late and be in a good mood than wake up early and be in a bad mood. And that's just the type of person I am. I just am not a morning person and i have been watching this new show well it's not new it's part of like the selling sunset like category you know the real estate shows uh, my favorite one is selling tampa nothing can compare to that one that one is like the number one for me and then it's selling sunset because of the drama if you like drama then you know you'll like that um and then the last one has to be selling orange county but i don't really like the, the vibe of the people in the show. I don't know, I don't like their vibe that much. But Selling Tampa was the best. I don't think they're gonna do a season two. Hopefully they do because I wanna see a season two from them. It was the best. Let me know which one is your favorite. And if you guys haven't seen it, I recommend you start watching Selling Tampa first and then Selling Sunset and then Selling Orange County. That one you don't even have to watch, it's not that good. So yeah guys, I'm actually gonna stop talking because I can talk for hours and hours and hours and nobody wants that. So I'll see you guys when I get to TMR. So I'm now in the home goods section. Oh my God, my hair's a mess. But yeah, I'm here. I got my frames from here actually for $80. They're super inexpensive. There's this one right here. I don't really like the gold. I feel like if this was in there, it would look a lot better. Let me see if I can find other things if i had like my own place i would get all my furniture from here because it's really inexpensive and also lost you guys look at all these pumpkins this is making me excited for fall not gonna lie i like this color like combined i feel like it will look really pretty i don't think i would do like traditional you know fall i would do like neutral color fall i feel like that would be really pretty Trying to decide which body wash I want to try this time around because I love testing out new body washes. I haven't smelled this one. Pure Peace. Kind of smells like, like water and roses. Yeah, it smells like gross water. My favorite one is the rice milk one. This one it smells really good. I'm like looking at myself, but I should be looking over here. Let me know which one is your favorite like body wash because I want something like new, you know? I feel like they haven't released any good scents recently. So I don't know what to get. I'm gonna get one of these. I don't know the difference of the color because I always get the yellow one, but they don't have that one. They only have like the purple one. So I don't know the difference, but hopefully I like this one. I cannot live without this. Like my body needs this because then it feels like super dry. I have also tried this brand before. I tried the salicylic acid one and I liked it, but I don't think it helps that much. My back acne, it doesn't help. That's why I got the sprayer. Hopefully that works better. Okay, so let's get into all the skin stuff that I got. I've been, I need to block Skims. That's another company I need to block. Target and Skims because they be taking my money. But yeah, Skims came out with their new pink collection. That sold out so fast. But there's a secret, you guys. There's a secret to buying Skims. You need to get on it early before early release or whatever. I don't think it's called early release. But yeah, whatever they call it, you know where you put your email and stuff like that? You can do that, which helps. But when a collection, like there's certain collections that you know they're gonna sell out fast. You want to make sure you get on it before even that so at my time i get on it at 8 45 a.m so that will be i think this is central time or mountain time so that's like my local time so you want to make sure you sign up for the email so they'll send you the email you know when they're gonna release something so let's say they're gonna release on wednesday right they're gonna send you an email saying new content collection releasing wednesday you're gonna click on that link and that day that it releases on Wednesday, you're gonna click on that link and you're gonna get on it early and it'll be there. So that's how I do it. Hopefully that makes sense. If not, you can just search it as well, like the exact color and it will come up. So yeah, that's what I do to get all my skim stuff. So this is the tank top that I got from Skims in the shade bubblegum pink. It's such a pretty pink. I've been super into like pink colors and just like this beautiful shade. So yeah, I got this one. 
in a size medium that is my size on skims and it fits me perfect there is a lot of stretch to it so they have this in a lot of different colors and i love how it's longer do you guys see it's super long this one it's called the cut and rip tank in bubble gum so let's open this which looks like this so you guys see the difference this one's more cropped and this one is covers you more at the front and also the bottom so that is the difference but the color is just so pretty so i got that i couldn't get the matching bottom because honestly i wasn't gonna get it until i saw everybody getting them and then i was like i want them but you know i didn't need them so yeah i got this same tank top the longer one in the shape smoke or the name in the shade smoke and a size medium everything in a size medium except for the bottom i do like to get a size large just so it doesn't fit tight i don't like tight fitting you know pajamas and stuff so they look like this you see this ones look bigger when i got this last time i got them in black and they seem very like tight but i think i'm a size medium on this too the t-shirts are amazing i believe this is the cut and jersey super stretchy i feel like they're worth it the t-shirts are worth it um again same color if you want to invest in skims make sure you get the t-shirts before you get anything else because like that you can not only wear them at your house but also to leave the house you know and then last thing i got it's the exact same thing but in a long sleeve and you see it's stretchy so you can get your regular size because it's stretchy and they wash very well i have a lot of different colors and they wash well you just want to make sure you like let them air dry so they don't shrink or anything like that i feel like clothes last a lot longer when you like air let them air dry you know yeah guys i'm actually gonna go and shower and have my full like self-care sunday routine i feel like sundays are perfect to get your life together so i'm gonna shave i'm probably gonna self tan as well i should have done it earlier today because i'm not trying to stain my bed i just washed it and not only that i got a new um fitted sheet i actually got it from walmart it was 50 dollars. i was a little surprised i was like 50 dollars, but the quality feels really good i'll show you guys all my new bedding since we're here okay so i was laying down so it's a little bit like not put together but this is my new bedding so this pillowcase that it came with it's like too long for my pillow so i don't know how i can make it look like it fits or does it look good i don't know but the pillow is like smaller but i cannot find a pillow that is like the same size of that so maybe it looks good like that i don't know but basically this is my new set walmart um this one's from target amazon like eight dollars and then this is from cb2 and this is from cb2 i ordered online and i really like it it's linen so this is what it looks like and then this is my new nightstand as well i just wanted something more like neutral and more texture which is why i picked that up and this one it's like an off-white so you know i figured it will look really good okay so i just got out of the shower i washed my hair i shaved you know i did like the whole sunday self-care routine um i also used this new product from be fresh i got it from target i bought it online and it's called the hydrating body serum it has hyaluronic acid and vitamin e and other things i do not know what they are but you know it sounds like it's gonna help my body look more moisturized and feel more moisturized so yeah this is what i use all over my body and it reminds me a lot of the necessary body serum but a lot more affordable but this one does smell like cupcakes it smells like vanilla yeah and like cupcake it smells like cupcake and the other one the necessary is fragrance free so you can use it on your face as well but if you're looking for the look for less you know same thing but a little bit less money i will recommend this product i feel like i need to declutter my makeup collection because i have so much remember when they used to release like a new palette every single week like why were we buying so many palettes like we don't need that so yeah i need to clean i did end up ordering my vanity so whenever that comes in if you guys want me to do like an organizing my vanity together you know maybe i can do it in another vlog so let me know in the comments below if you guys would like to see more vlogs from me but yeah guys i'm gonna go i hope you guys are having a beautiful day or night whenever you're watching this video and yeah i'll see you guys on the next one Mwah. bye guys <laughs>